name, but first tonight, a developing story out of Orange County tonight. State police say they've made an arrest in the shooting of an Orange County investigator. It's an update we broke first on our web channel, newsplex.com. Now, the shooting happened earlier today in the 13,000 block of Markey Road in the Unionville community of Orange County. 19 News Nightcast reporter Jessica Jagloy's word of this arrest came about 10 o'clock tonight, right? That's right, Jennifer. It all started this morning, though. Robert Canosa was shot multiple times in his Unionville home around 6 o'clock a.m. He was off duty when he was shot, and as police make an arrest, it's who shot him that may surprise you. Robert Canosa arrived at UVA Medical Center early this morning. The Orange County investigator was helicoptered after being shot several times. Police say the person responsible is Canosa's estranged wife, Brenda. Police arrested Brenda Lee Canosa shortly before 10 p.m. Friday night. She was arrested on one count of attempted first-degree murder, one count of malicious wounding, and one count of using a firearm in the commission of a felony. She was arrested while her husband remains at UVA Hospital. While doctors fight inside the hospital for Canosa's life, those we spoke to earlier today say they are shocked by the crime. The owner of Marshall Farms Corner says Canosa comes into her store almost every morning for breakfast. She says she found it unusual when he didn't show up Friday morning. I didn't see him this morning and thought maybe he was on a case or something. That curiosity turned into shock after hearing Canosa had been shot. It's horrible. It's horrible, especially when you know them and you're, you know, they're a part of your life. It's very sad. Orange County Sheriff Mark Amos says that the police department is praying for Canosa. Earlier today, Amos commented that Canosa's experience as a Marine has helped him. He commended his strength while choking back tears. I think that helped him through the day. Uh, In what way? He's strong. He's a strong man. Those close to Canosa hopes he stays strong as he will stay in their continued thoughts and prayers. Now, police arrested Ms. Canosa at her residence shortly before 10 p.m. She is now being held at the Central Virginia Regional Jail. Live in the Newsplex, Jessica Jagloy's 19 News Nightcast. All right, Jessica, thank you very much. Our other top story tonight, the Cavalier men's soccer team took the field tonight.